Hey everyone, it is me, TNT, and I am back with another episode on the Minefighter server. You will see below me a fully finished Trident farm, and I'll get to that in a second, but uh, just really, really fast. Uh, the server is actually closing down soon, so that's not good. I'm very, very sad. Um, it's the, basically, um, there's been problems with like money and whatnot because uh, die cake and beast are the only two paying for the server and i mean servers are expensive guys anyway um and they think that there's only going to be like one more month of the server being open and then they're going to close it down for a little bit and then season two will come back and everything but we don't have much time with this world so we got we got to get working on things which is one of the reasons why I finished this Trident farm without recording uh, it's all done now only thing is it's not working cuz for some reason I cannot make farms that work it just it life won't allow me to uh the only problem is we're not getting spawns because drowns hate us apparently I thought of a new place to put this that is actually better cuz I always see drowns there and that's in this little place in the desert uh, so we'll, we, we might do that later, but as of right now, we are going to go work on our base. Now I do have this guy, he's new, he's cool, looking at it. Problem is, we're just not getting drowned spawning, which is really, really weird. They should spawn, I mean, I know they don't spawn in warm water, but this is a deep, cold ocean. They, they should be spawning. Alright, so I paid this guy two stacks of diamonds in advance and he's going to move my whole thing to a new area test it out make sure it's all good i'm going to give him a few eggs so he can test it out uh come to base or eggs uh turtle eggs if you guys do not know drowns hate them so yeah that's great <laughs> so you can see if they'll actually come after them to test areas out and i should have done that but i wasn't thinking anyway uh I, I think it's worth it. I mean, like, two stacks is a lot, but also he just started out, so he needs it. And also, I mean, like, I'm kind of rich, so not a big deal, you know? Uh, and also, um, 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 oh yeah, the server's closing down soon, so, you know, not a big deal. But anyway, today we're doing something big, and I mean big. So if you guys can't see from what, what we're doing right now, um, well, from where we're looking, we have done one quarter of the UFO, and this is going to be our, um, storage system. Now, with such a short time, uh, with the SMP being open and, you know, running, uh, I decided to just skip finishing the UFO and go right to the storage system because I've been wanting to do this for a while, and... Well, I think that we should just go for it. So right now I'm just gonna build up a few walls, not too terribly high, but you know, not like super low. Uh, and then we're we're just gonna go for it. <laughs> All right. So Daikik gave us a stack and five hoppers, uh, just for free because that's Daikik for you. Uh, and then also, um, I'm going to buy a whole bunch of wood and iron and whatnot and make a lot more. So we are basically totally out of iron, but we now have one, two, three, and four-ish stack, well, three and a half stacks of hoppers. Well, it took me about an hour, but I have officially planned out where everything is going uh, for our storage system. Oh, I forgot to do this. Okay, never mind. All right, so it took about an hour, but I finally figured out where everything is going in our storage system. And I even filled up a few here, so uh, let's say that we wanted to, for example, uh, take some sticky pistons, which has nothing in it, and these are actually just regular pistons. And we just throw them into this water stream. You'll see that they go and pass a lot of things. And then... What? Alright, so it took well over an hour, but now if we throw some things in this chest like a dispenser or a hopper, it will be sorted through into this big thing. Um, I This was just me laying out everything. Oop, my bad. Um, and seeing, you'll see that there's gaps right here, and that's because instead of hoppers on the top, I did water uh, system, where it shot the uh, it through water. But I found that that was not terribly reliable, so I'm going to change it to hoppers. It's going to be a little bit slower, and it's going to be a lot more expensive, but what can you do? So you'll see that all the droppers should have been sorted through. So if we go over here to the, uh, not droppers, I mean dispensers, you'll see that there's 64 there, and you'll see that the hoppers are flowing in right now. 
I didn't hook up all these so that worked. I just hooked up like the first few to make sure. And then this is the other side, by the way. And once again, there's gaps and we'll fix those later, but this is what we have so far. So, okay guys, we're, we're, we are finally doing this. Um, so let's see, I know that's five blocks away. Let's actually get just a few, uh, just like regular cobblestone, cause that's gonna be our main block. So I know that it starts like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, it was eight, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, it was eight. And then this is the block that the first one's actually on. Uh, and that's gonna be a stair. And then I don't actually remember how far away it is from the edge, but we're gonna get the chest all laid out uh, first, and then we'll do all the redstone and everything. Actually, the first one, we'll do it. Just make sure that we're at the right length and everything. Okay, so we need a repeater facing this way. And then a block here, redstone dust on there, a block on top of here, redstone dust on top of that, another block and another block, redstone dust, a comparator, let's get rid of this block, and let's put a block here, and then this has a redstone torch, I believe, yes, and then right here are the hoppers that are going in, and our chests, oops. Wait, yeah, our chest is right, right here. Yeah, yeah, I think, I think we did it. I think that's how it works. So I know you need a lot of filler items when doing storage systems. So you just have to like name random blocks, random like things. So I'm just gonna like, you know, name it totally random, you know, just, just random. Yeah, mm-hmm, 100% random, guys. All right, so we made the first working chest, so you'll, oop, I'm gonna take that. Uh, you'll see that it stopped at 41, that's the correct amount, so if we put, like, let's say, uh, some iron in here, it will not go down because this hopper is locked and it, it won't be able to go into any of these slots. But if we put in some redstone, you'll see that it will start going down and it'll end up in this chest right here. So that's awesome. Now we're just going to go right through to the end and mark all the chests and get everything set up before we do all the redstone. Thank you, Die Kick, for trapping us in the obsidian and giving us a whole bunch of item frames. Remember that prank, guys? <laughs> yeah. Well, it took like an hour again, but I got all of this in. Whew, only half of it because we still have that half, but I'm just trying to get this half done. Uh, and that, that was definitely the goal until it took such a long time. And I think that's all we have time for today, sadly. So, if you guys like this video, then please hit that like button. Uh, if you guys want to see more videos from me, then please hit that subscribe button and make sure to hit that notification bell if you want to be notified every single time I post a new video or when I live stream. Uh, but I hope you guys have a good day and goodbye.